Hello YouTube, it's Tiny. Hey, uh, I just wanted to <clears throat> make a, a quick video here. Uh, I just happened to read an article uh, from a Phoenix, Arizona area newspaper about a woman getting mauled by a bear. And, um, they, uh, I believe they killed the bear to test to see if it had rabies or whatever. And they're almost positive that this is the bear that, the, the one that did the mauling and stuff. Um, but, my question is, is, uh, you know, um, how do you guys feel about them killing the bear because it attacked the person? Um, you know, for years, um, cities are growing and getting bigger and bigger and bigger, and, uh, they're taking away the animal's habitat. So, you know, I mean, honestly, where are these animals supposed to go? Like, um, if you take away all the forest, or, and you develop it into, you know, housing, or shopping centers, or resorts, you know, where are these wild animals supposed to go? Like, honestly, I mean, where are they supposed to go? Um, <clears throat> and... It is starting to happen more and more. Um, and not with just bear. Um, I have read stories about uh, deer, elk, you know. Um, you know, all these big game animals that are attacking people. Or you, you see videos of it all the time. Like... Uh, I saw a video one time on YouTube where a uh, white-tailed deer was stuck in a swing set at a public playground. Um, you know, really, you know, everybody, you know, cries out, oh, it's the animal, the animal, the animal. But, you know, the animals are only doing what they've been taught to do for centuries. And, you know, if you sit back and really, really, really think about it, we are intruding on them. They're not intruding on us. Um, you know, everybody builds and builds and builds and builds without thinking of you know, the ramifications of their actions, um, you know, they build these big towns and big cities, and, you know, and then, you know, when, when things like what happened in this article happen, you know, you got people say, kill all the animals off, and, you know, and then you have the animal rights activists, oh, no animals should be hurt, um, that's why I support hunting. I mean, um, you know, hunting is a way, it's a tool. Hunting, you know, is a tool. And, uh, but <clears throat> hunting can only do so much. Um, you know, when is just taking as much land as you want gonna stop you know these animals don't have anywhere else to go you know and then you want to know why you got like maulings and people like these animals killing people or you know you, you see so many um deer being hit by cars it's because you know those deer have been using those same trails for years and years and years and all of a sudden man decides well we want to build here and we're going to put a highway here so then 
you know, the insurance companies raise your automobile rates up because of the number of, you know, claims that they have because of what they call act of God. Um, which means, basically, you know, um, like if an animal runs out in front of you and destroys your car, you know, they have to pay to fix your car because it wasn't something that you caused, but an animal ran out in front of you. And, uh, you know, everybody complains about this happening, but, you know, honestly, where is the blame really to be put? It's surely not the animals. They were here way before we were ever here. You know, um, but yet, you know, you have people that say, you know, these animals are a menace, they need to be eliminated, blah, you know, and, 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 and it's not the animal's fault that, that things are like that. It's human's fault that we're intruding on the animal so much. You know, um, for animal rights activists, you know, they say that no animal should be killed or whatever. You know, hunting is a tool. Um, it's used to help control po the animal population. And, you know, when you have proper control over, you know animal population, you don't have as many problems with wild animals, but by the same token, by us just keep developing land so we can live in these lavish houses and have these big high-rises and, and, you know, all these shopping centers because you know, we live in a very materialistic society, um, honestly, you know, why are the animals being blamed for being the bad ones? You know, you know, obviously they killed that bear to test it because the only way to test an animal for rabies, in case you don't know, is they have to test the brain. That is the only way to test it. So therefore they have to kill the animal and test it. You know, that is the only way to test for rabies. They think that the bear had rabies and that's why it was attacking. At least that's kind of what I'm gathering from the article. And I'm going to put an ink, a link to the article down in the information bar down below. But, uh... You know, I would like to get your thoughts on, you know, the human expansion into, you know, wildlife's territory. I mean, really, you know, they're not the ones to blame. We are. And, uh... I just want to know what you guys think about it, you know. Uh, please comment below. And, uh, uh, if you like my videos, uh, please subscribe and rate, and, uh, we'll see you in the next one, and, uh, take it easy.